This is your pelvic cuff. Wow, I never noticed how nice that fits. <laughs> Good morning! It's 9.15. I have been up since 6 a.m., which I'm very proud of myself. My goal is actually to get up at 5. I have gone through periods of my life where I've gotten up at 5 a.m. and I love it because I get so much done in the mornings. Super productive in the mornings, have all these ideas and insights and I'm always really excited. And then by the time I get home from class and I've eaten lunch, I mean, I'm still productive, but it's just not the same. I don't have the same energy that I have in the morning. And so anyway, my goal is to get up. I'm just changing the battery in this camera because Something very exciting is happening today, which I think you guys are gonna be really happy about. I think you are, because there's been lots of requests. Please excuse my disaster of a living room here. And I've had to. Emily's bag is still here from when she was here and then was sick. Like, I've just pulled out all my bones from the Franklin cupboard. Well, this is all here from yesterday's planning session. And then all my Franklin books and bands, and I have ankle weights on. Anyway, so, it's a bit mess. I'm sure many of you are like, oh, that's not messy at all. You should see my house. What was I talking about? Oh yes, getting up early. So it feels really nice. When do you get up? I would like to know. Does anyone get up really early? Are you a, like 5 a.m., 6 a.m., get her upper? I'm just rolling on my foam roller here. And if so, how do you like it? How did you get into that pattern? What time do you go to bed? Because I feel like that's the, that's the key, is getting to bed early enough to wake up and then just getting into a habit of it so that it just becomes normal. And that's how it has been. But it's kind of tough when it's still dark out. I don't really like waking up in the dark, but I also do like seeing the sunrise. So anyway, today, oh yeah, fun video creation. We are going to be filming a wee dance day, finally. I'm really sorry. This is my like, a wee dance day apology. As you guys know, or you will know if you've been following me for a while, you know that I love dancing and I love dancing all over the place. And I also love making wee dance days, which is every Wednesday, me and whoever goes dance, goes dance, go, and dance somewhere random, some public place, and just have a lot of fun and get people to join in and just go crazy in just a really fun way. I've been making me dance days for a few years now, but we have not had somebody to like focus on making me dance days because it's kind of a lot of work to do and to plan and to film and then to edit and we just haven't had all the help. Plus when it was winter, it was so cold and it just kept not happening. And anyway, I'm really sorry. And I do really want them to happen every week. So if you know any dance filmmakers out there, if you are one, and you want to help us make We Dance Days, I would love that. There's also just so many other things with daily vlogs and superhuman fitness and all the other content that wants to be created, sometimes we dance days don't get prioritized. But I know, particularly the mums, <laughs> my mum and Jess's mum, um, were like, why is we dance day? We miss we dance day. I'm like, we have to prioritize it. So I'm just warming up my feet. And I've been planning my video that I'm gonna film tomorrow that I'm really excited for you to see, which is gonna be coming out next Tuesday, hopefully. And that is my workout routine. So anyway, that was a bit of a long ramble. Um, but just wanted to show you, what can I show you this morning to inspire you? How about this? This is your pelvic cuff. Wow, I never noticed how nice that fits on my head. Oh, oh that's really nice. So <laughs> this, um, this is your pelvic calf. This is the top of the ilium here. So I have to touch with my face because I'm holding my camera. <laughs> this bit at the back, this knobbly bit is your PSIS. 
Can you see the beautiful wave in it? Isn't that cool? And the front there, the ASAS. And then I've got my thumb in the hip joint. And then you've got this nice peak hole. This is your pubic bone. Ooh, here. And I also just happened to open Eric's book, Dynamic Alignment Through Imagery. And he's got a beautiful picture here of the pelvic calf showing its triplanar rotation. Really awesome. Oh my gosh, I could just read these books all day long. Look how nice this is. This is an image of the sacrum and kind of the propeller acting like a propeller pushing out the two pelvic halves. I'm going to finish ankle weighting and then go to ballet. And the other thing I wanted to show you is my compost. Compost, compost, which I'll show you in a moment. <laughs> Thanks. Three bags of compost. Success. So what I've been doing is just putting my food scraps in those compost bags and stick them in the freezer. And now I can bring them here. And they can be properly composted. I feel like a better human. Yes. So let me know, do you compost? And uh, yeah, how can we get more people composting? vlog mama for a little bit. I feel a little bit dizzy. Mm, so I'm being the mommy that I'm into. We are going on our way out now for We Don't Say. I'm excited about it. Yay! We haven't done one in a while since actually my birthday which was December 2nd. So it feels good to be getting back in the game and now it's time to figure out what song we're gonna do. Do you guys have any requests for maybe not this We Dance Day but future ones? So if you, <laughs> <laughs> if you have future requests uh, for future We Dance Days, Wild songs and stuff, let us know. And for now, let's play some songs and we'll see. You know Wild Things? Oh. Mm. By Alessia Cara. Oh, I love his song. Yeah. Oh, this is perfect. Let's do it. Oh. That was easy. We'll see if Laura likes it, but I really like it. I feel like this song could prompt like one of Laura's like interpretive solo modern dances. I think so too. I think it might be the revival key. What do we think about the song? So we are off to Central Park. Feels fun having Melinda in the game. Yeah, I'm just vlogging you. Show sure everyone, show sure everyone Vienna. <laughs> and I'm here at Central Park. So these guys have been rocking it already. Rapping the weed dance. And I just took a tour around Vienna with Eric. And now I'm gonna go dance, but I do feel a little odd. Kind of like I'm in the middle of her swirly thing. Really dizzy, and another woman at ballet actually said she felt dizzy too. It's a full moon and an eclipse, and everything else. So, okay. what Ready? did you say? Nothing, yeah, you did. What did she say? Oh, look, I'm loving this routine. They're like some cute. something cute, okay? Mm -hmm. Very cute. All right, I'm gonna do my best it. effort now, and that's a wrap. Still want my flowers in yeah, my hair. Yay! How do you dizzy. feel, Laura? How do you feel? Still dizzy. Now. Still dizzy, but cool. Look at the horses. Better.
with lots of new pics and vids. I got really carried away with my like creative eyeballs. I could just stay taking pictures and like little video clips forever. But it's nice that I do do that <laughs> every day. So we are heading back home, obviously, for lunch. Lunchy lunch. Look at those nice buds over there. This is happening. Yay, yay. Yeah. More planning's happening. Fiona, thank you. I just finally went and opened mm. my mailbox. Um, I just had an interview, by the way, which was very lovely. And that that was done. Lady called Tracy. Hey, Tracy, if you're watching. Look what Fiona sent me. A really cute card saying, So, Laura, I mean, Laura, sorry, I'm a bit tired. Laura, so glad you learnt how amazing stingrays are. Couldn't resist sending you this. Oh, floppy stingray kisses and sparkles, Fiona. Thank you. Look what she sent me. Oh, oh my goodness. Look at this. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. This is like the best. Look at that. It's a freaking stingray dish towel. I love it. Actually, is that a stingray or is that jellyfish? I think it's a jellyfish, actually. No, of course it's jellyfish. Here's a stingray. Here's the stingray. Laura's confused. It's a jellyfish. It's gorgeous. Look at that. Thank you, Fiona. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Emily. Say hi. Hi. I'm <laughs> just chatting. Emily's been sick for the past. For how many days? Today's day four. Oh um, boy. I know. Oh, miss ya. Yeah. Let's say good night to everyone. Good night, everyone. Night night. We're going to bed. Going <laughs> <laughs> to watch a movie. Going okay, to watch a movie. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed today. Give Emily some get better soon in the comments. Yay, thanks.